foremost, congratulations on a grand finale to one heck of a rookie season. What do you make of the exclamation point you were able to put on your season today with two perfect innings? Yeah, it was cool. Um, definitely glad to be able to finish the season. And, um, you know, cool to do it here, cool to do it against this, this lineup. So, um, yeah, wish I could keep going, but that's where we're at. Yeah, I said that it seems like the bigger the moment, the better you get. What did it mean to be able to get a rematch against some of those guys and strike out a guy like Aaron Judge today? Um, yeah, I mean, it's cool. It's not It's it's not the first time I've faced him. It's definitely not going to be the last. So, um, you know, looking forward to the next time. What did you just think of Yankee Stadium? Oh, uh, it was cool. I like New York. I like, you know, the stadiums just, it's one of the, the you know, destinations in baseball for sure. Uh, you know, a place to, to you know, cross off your bucket list, but cool to, you know, be out there and pitch and um, definitely going to, you know, keep checking it out tomorrow because it's just it's a cool place to go out there and, and look up at, you know, when you're in the outfield and that kind of thing. Have you got a chance to see money before? Uh, no, I haven't. Is that in center field? Yeah. Yeah, I haven't. Paul, when you look through, you know, your rookie year and the plan they had you on, do you think it could have gone any better the way they built you up this year and finished you off? Yeah, I, I don't think so. Um, because we got right to where the, the innings uh, threshold was, so uh, for, you know, frustrating first couple of months, but um, you know, glad to be able to do what I did this year. And do you feel like it kind of put you in a good spot for next year, where you're going to be able to kind of just go through without really any concerns? Yeah, I think so. You know, just take the ball and pitch. Yeah. I don't have to. I mean, if someone told you back, I guess in February, this is how your rookie year would go. Are you happy with how it went? Do you think you just kind of your yeah, I don't, I don't know. I didn't really have a ton of expectations going into it. I had just to you know go out there every five or six days or whatever and execute um, whatever that looks like. Um, so I don't know what else I could have done, but um, definitely happy with with how the season went. Just saying this after just a couple hours after you pitched your last pitch, but you've known at all what you want your 2020 clubs. Win a lot of baseball games. Your manager said that even if you were the rookie of the year, have you allowed yourself to think about that possibility? Do you feel like you belong in that conversation? Um, yeah, I think I belong in that conversation. I don't know. I haven't, I haven't thought about it a ton, but um, yeah, I'll, I'll think about it in the next few weeks, I guess, but um, haven't haven't thought about it as well. Just you know, the, the focus has been you know, to to finish the season strong and go out there and execute. And, um, you know, that's going to end up however it ends up. I know. I know. You said you know you wish you could have continued pitching, obviously, meaning the playoffs and everything. But are you ready for a little bit of a break here? You ready for this off season? Not really. No. Um, yeah, I think that's. One thing about being at Yankee Stadium, uh, they clinched the night before we came. You know, while we were, they clinched when we got here. Yeah. You know, the, the night before the series started. So, um, yeah, a lot to to build off of for next year. But um, yeah, just gotta gotta go win. How do you feel just going into the off season? Maybe just you know, kind of developing a plan going into the off season, just wanting to you know, work on things, and just how do you kind of uh, approach uh, going into the off season for the first time after a uh, full major league season? Yeah, I think there's some yeah. lying and proof for me to be better next year. So, um, you know, just gonna attack that, um, talk to my coaches, and, and develop a plan once the off season actually starts too. So, um, but got a plan and, and ready to put the work in. Paul, how exciting was it to watch Burroughs come out after you, make his debut and execute the way he did after everything he's gone through with Tommy John? Yeah, yeah, pretty dang cool, especially to do it here. Um, it's a, just, you know, kind of an odd uh, circumstance having to piggyback me um, to make his debut, but uh, just a really cool experience for him, I hope, and it was, it was awesome to watch. Thank you for checking out this content from Post Gazette Sports. If you watch this video on YouTube, please like the video and subscribe to our channel. For all of the sports coverage the Post Gazette has to offer, visit post-gazette.com.